Read Lab have a package for you, and I want him to talk about it and how does the package work. Okay, um, during the our farmers business meeting, farmers were like, okay, can we get something like NHIS, like NHIS in humans, can we get it for our animals? I was like, okay, we can do that. Hmm. Now, we mentioned that and we said, okay. So I called the team and then we agreed on, on the modality. So now what we are doing is, we are not just going to be uh, diagnosing. Hmm. We have also seen other components of the business that are very important. Okay. Basically, because raw materials have gone very, very high. Most mm. of the input is high. Yeah. You cannot afford to be losing animals coupled with that. Mm. I, I, you even said when you lose an animal, like you calculated what you have lost in that your production. I think we are going to come back to that. Especially for, for what it is, now what we are trying to help farmers see is the cost of the losses. Mm. Because though that is where the profitability of the business is, is affected. Okay. When you keep losing animals, Animals that have taken, for example, in the case of fish, maybe your fish is already 500 grams. You're losing 70, mm. losing 50, mm. losing 10 mm. every day or every other day. Mm. You may not see that as a great loss until at the end of the cycle. That's so true. we felt that, okay, can we do something that helps farmers first prevent those things? Okay. By doing regular farm visits under the animal health and wellness scheme. It's a plan we have put in place to help farmers to be able to first know the cause of disease second understand why the animals are actually going down what are the precautionary measures to put in place to okay. ensure that that doesn't happen and when it happens it will reduce the uh, the high costs of uh, diagnosis and, and i think that the, the one of the things that makes farmers shy away from diagnosis is the cost hmm, that's true but farmers will not look at it that okay how many birds have i lost hmm. how many fish have i lost in a certain period of time. It has a cost. So we have decided that, okay, let's do that. Help farmers prevent, also help them track uh, productivity and performance on the okay. farm. Then the one that we are adding to it, and I think that's the first in the industry that we're doing. Mm. We've added accounting package to it. Okay. So now we are help, have accountants in the office that we have put together and say, okay, they monitor the day-to-day -day spending of the business and then at the end of the month, we we'll give them a report of statement of financial position and say, look, Sir, this area stop there. This area reduce it. Mm. This area, if you can do this, this mm. is what we have mm. in monetary terms. Mm. Mm. Then we also do the technical side of the business, animal health, and then say, okay, sir, if you make any go down, this place that you have put this thing is not is not mm. so good. So mm. we have added that to it, and then some businesses are not legitimate. Okay, with CAC registration, we are also supporting. Uh, the farmers with that at, at a very very easy in the office. So mm. basically. AHS plan is to de-risk the business of animal farm mm. and ensure that it comes at a very, very cheap. And today, that is the cheapest mm. in the country. Okay. There's no subscription plan that you have that somebody is saying, come and pay 20000 and say, we'll visit your farms every time that you need to be. And mm. then take samples. Because every time we come, we'll come to the farm, observe, take samples, and give you a current report 